Interview Log 1. Toga. League of Villains. Team member. So, is it true about what they say? Is what true about what who says? About your quirk. Can you really take the blood of other heroes? Yeah, I can. Not only that, I can be any one of them. And I can be at them at any time I want. Fascinating. Is there any drawbacks to this? Any known drawbacks at all? Now, if there were, why would I tell you? You know what's really interesting, though? Is the fact that I can mix and match. You know? I think you're lying to me. I don't think you can do that at all. You think I'm lying? Really? Is that really what you think? Are you trying to play mind games with me? Why would I want to play mind games with a brainless idiot like you? <laughs> That'd be no fun. You wouldn't even get all the jokes. <laughs> I'm trying to have a serious conversation here with you. Maybe we could get to the bottom of this and actually get somewhere. Get to where? What are you trying to get? I'm trying to figure out where your leader is. Now, you should tell me now, before this gets ugly. Uglier than you, I'm assuming. <laughs> How about you grow up? How about that? Do you have any idea what's going to happen when you get older and get into this whole thing? Yeah, I do. It's going to be a lot of fun. Especially when the heroes never really paid attention. You get my drift? Elaborate now. Elaborate now. That's how you sound. How did you do that? You weren't even near me. You, d you don't even have your weapons. You remember that prick that happened earlier? Yeah, that was me. Now I can do your voice. <laughs> Ain't it just amazing? <laughs> Stop that right now! Oh, I'm sorry. Is that too much for you? Well, you know, I could always do someone else's voice for you if you like. I mean, who would you like to hear? Uh, I have everything. I have everyone. Would you like to hear Margie from down the street? I'm sure she wouldn't mind talking to you. <laughs> You're sick and twisted. Now, is that any way to talk to me? Little old me. Stop this right now, before I have to. Before you have to what? There's nothing going on here. All you're doing is just getting angry at me. I didn't do anything wrong. Can you really point the finger at me? You were seen. I was seen. By who? By what? And where's your proof at that I was seen at all? We have surveillance footage of you going in and out of this building. We assume that it's where the League of Villains meet. Am I correct? That particular building is a decoy. A decoy, you say? Yeah, I say it's a decoy. Why else would I say it? So you admit it is a decoy? No, it's not a decoy. I promise you, I have better things to do than lie. I mean, come on. You've been staking out a decoy? Crazy. How do I know that you're not lying? Again, with the lying. Dude, I've literally never lied to you at all. I just met you. Again, why would I have any need to lie to you for? Can you give me a good reason why I would need to? To stall me into not capturing you or anyone else in your league. You see, I'm going to be honest with you even more now. Being honest is a great thing. Being honest is a great thing. Yeah, of course it is. Alright. You do that one more time, I swear I- You swear you'll what? What are you going to do? You're just mad because I can do you better than you. Well, here. How about this? How about I 
use someone else's voice that's familiar to you. Would that make you feel better? How could you possibly make a voice? Or do a voice that would possibly be familiar to me? <laughs> oh, I've got a voice for you. Actually, I've got two. And they are pretty good. They're, for granted, my last victims. I mean, they... How should I put this? They were less favorable. They didn't want to willingly do this. So I had to improvise, if you will. Improvise? What do you mean? Take a wild guess on what I did. I can't tell you right off the bat. I mean, that's no fun. How about you take a wild guess? Did you kidnap them and hide their bodies? Oh, I hid their bodies, all right. But I didn't kidnap them. It was more of a B and E, if you get what I mean. So you admit to breaking and entering of a house? Oh yeah, that was me. I did that. <laughs> <sighs> but you never asked who it was. Now again, I'll ask you. Can you guess who the familiar voices are? Fine, I'll play your game. What familiar voices do you know and have that I would know? Well, I assume that you'll know this one. I mean, he used to call you son, didn't he? <laughs> what? How? Son, please. You have to help us. You have to protect us before we die. <laughs> <laughs> you sick, twisted person. What have you done to them? Oh, come on. It's no fun if I just tell you. <laughs> It's still a guessing game. Take a wild guess on what I did to your folks. You monster. I should... You should what? You see, there's only one way this is going to go down. One of us is going to die. And the other one's going to get off scot-free. Do you know which one? That's it. I'm going to... No, no, no. That's not good. You know what? Here. Have a present. <laughs> no, no. You might want to not talk very much. <sighs> but you know what? I will take your your outfit, okay? I'll take the whole SWAT uniform, everything you got. I'll even take your face. Now, I want you to be honest with me. All right. How's this? Is this a good voice? Do you smile a lot? Is that what you do? Or do you even do that at all? And don't worry. You'll be with your parents again. I mean, they were about to kick the bucket anyway. I just put the bucket on in front of them. <laughs> what do you say? <laughs> Oh, that's right. I'm sorry. You can't speak. Well, I guess I'll have to disfigure your face and just tell them that you got a little out of hand. Won't I? Ugh. I need backup. I had to put one down. Ugh, it's so messy in here. Make sure to deep clean this place. Don't want to leave any evidence here for others to possibly try and recreate this freak. Over and out. <laughs>